Well, with the holiday season here, talk about a perfect time to visit Wild. It's a good thing he doesn't have teeth yet. Wildlife World Zoo. Uh, this little guy is only two weeks old. It's a baby warthog, and Christy's joining us this morning. I have to say, this is one of the cutest things you've ever brought in. I agree. I can barely talk. I'm so overwhelmed with cuteness. Oh, he cuteness. does have a tooth. He and does have a tooth back there. So he does he's got have a tooth his back little there. tusks, and sometimes <laughs> you'll feel them when he's sitting there. Uh, yeah. Look at the way he drops down on his knees. Climbing on things, and he's showing off a very natural behavior. These guys will actually kneel down, and that's how they're going to root around for food. They have callus pads, and that's what's going to protect them <laughs> when they're out there rooting around. And Raylan here is the little man. <laughs> He's so awesome. he'll grow to be over 300 pounds. He's going to get a lot bigger 300 pounds, that's yeah. hard to believe. There we go. Oh my gosh, he is something else. He is, he's so sweet. And these guys are amazing. Warthogs are so misunderstood. Usually when you bring up warthogs, people think that they're yeah. smelly and gross. Yeah. But they're amazing and they're yeah. so precious. They do eat bugs, they're omnivores, so they'll eat a variety of different things like bugs, plants, fruit, and uh, their little tail is my favorite thing about them because their little tail will actually stand up. So I'm gonna see if he follows me around if he'll get his little tail. Waylon! <laughs> right now he's wagging it. So it's like a little like string a little hanging off the back there. That's hilarious. There we go. Can you get him to go out on the wood there? He, he, yeah. uh, he'll he spin out and he slides, he, sl he gets going so fast he slides and falls down. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't have the best traction right now on the wood. There we go. <laughs> now, are they that friendly even as adults? I mean, if they're raised like this? So, Waylon is going to be a little ambassador for, or I should say, a big ambassador for his yeah. species when he gets older. Because they are such misunderstood animals, we'll be able to take them around. He is extraordinarily friendly. So, typically, they're not this friendly. We've been doing a lot of work with Waylon, a lot of positive reinforcement training. And for being only a couple weeks old, he is doing amazing. So, this is. His first behavior that there we go. Good job, Waylon. <laughs> and for him right now, uh, with positive reinforcement training, when they do something that you want them to, you reward them with something positive. Well, he's not into treats or anything yet. He just loves attention, attention and lovings and that. little nose scratches. You know, so normally with a pig, you 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 think of them as their snout being really messy, but he he's not. No. Will it, will it be that way someday, or is he always going to be clean like this? Well, these guys love the mud, and uh, yeah. just like other pigs do, they'll wallow in the mud when it's really hot, and that cools them off with evaporative cooling. Oh, okay. All so right. when it's hot outside, he'll be a little muddy. Boy, but... is he ever cute. <laughs> I, I, I got to tell you, you 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 won the award for cuteness today. That's, Agreed. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so Wildlife World Zoo. Thank you so much, Christy. I thank don't know you. how you're going to top that one. I know.